and I only need five. Five, so one. Number one, stand in a line here. Coming. Two. Two, no, 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 two. Two here. Sorry, my bad. Three here. Two more. Christoph, four. One more. Five. Straight line for me. Okay, so jump in, just jump in a straight line. So, defenders, you'll always go to the blue cones, please. Attack, you must go to the white cones. Everyone must touch a different cone. You can't go to the same cones. I will shout two numbers. It will always be one, two, three, four, five from me. Okay, so if I shout four and five, you two are the defenders. You must go to two different blue cones. You must go to three white cones. Okay, so just walk through four and five. I got four back. I got four back. Yeah. Okay, and then play. Yes, inside. Yeah, I'm inside. Yeah, I'm inside. Yep. Yeah, ball, yeah, ball. Okay. Brilliant. Great demonstration. Okay, reset. Okay, we're going to do two, and then I'm going to ask for some feedback. Just defenders don't know what to do. Okay, straight line on me. On me, take a step. One and five. Yeah, first I got deep, I got deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, hold, man, come, man, come, yeah, man, come, yeah. Yeah. Hold, 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 Oh, have that in the face, Christoph. Okay, right. Uh, so, coaches on the side, what have I done there? What am I manipulating? In, in comparison to this one, what am I manipulating? What am I changing? The start position. Okay, do we always start in the same place? No, especially when we're playing in broken play. Remember the game we played when we were all over the place? We're changing the angles of running. So what are we having to do to get ourselves in the positions? Adapt. Because if, guys, give me three players on the white for me, please. And give me one on the blue, far blue, and one on this blue. Right, so if I go here, where's the space if I'm the touchline? Space is there, but if I hit the pass there, so it's a kick return, what do you two need to do? You need to get back in play. What do you need to do? Fix someone. Preserve the space. So when we're thinking, so if you run in here to preserve the space, what are you going to do? Why? Yeah, I'm going to work into here. Okay, if they then drift, what could you do? Change your line again. So Christoph pushes across because they've read my line. You guys are coming. Boom, you take that late cut. Alright, so we're now just starting to really play about with our running lines and broken play and mix it up. Okay, that was we'll give it another shot. How would we make this harder? But harder for defense. More space, so we could spread the cones even further. Okay, how can we make it harder for the attack? Give me one more attacker. Yeah. Uh, one more defender. So give me six. So we've now got six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, you now need to go to the orange cone. So I need two defenders round two blue cones. So we'll make it real easy. No, you're <laughs> So we need two defenders to the blue, one defender to the orange. What's that defender now doing? Jason, all right. So I'm, I'm, we're, we're gonna walk through this so we get our head around it. Okay, one, two, three. I got four, I got four, I got four. So, hold, stop, stand still. Stand still, good. So, we've got, so we'll go back to your cones just so that we're in. So, we now, what is our pressure? So, if I pass here, you've got something, so you've got to go. Okay, so we're now having to do what on the move? We're now having to scan on the move. I can't just plant. What are we very guilty of as fullback? Any fullbacks or wingers? Yeah. What happens when the ball gets kicked over? Bang! What do I do now? Where's the space? All right. <coughs> What's that allowing to happen all the time? Fence are gaining ground all the time, especially if I let the ball bounce. 
all right? So if I get it in there, I want to catch it and chew up that space and make my decision on the run. And we'll do a lot of that stuff tomorrow in the counter attack. Okay, so we're going to give this one a shot. So we now have, you get double points defense if the person from behind catches them. Okay, so we've got to really kick them off. Start in the middle, start in the middle. Okay, so count off for me quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four, five, six. Two, four, five. Sunday round the orange. Good, off load, off load, off load. Finish with the score. Well done. That's all right. So. Good stuff. I purposely don't want you to know who's doing what because I don't want us. What have we then, defenders? What have we got to do? We've got to react. Okay, if I see two people going, ah, I need to go back. Okay, ready? One, one three, four. Orange, orange. Yeah, good, Crystal. Play. Chase them down, Crystal. Good. Oh. Oh, really good, though. Okay, we're now starting. Well, one more. Let's see if we can score. One, two, three, four. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Good, 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 so the defenders are coming from different angles. We're getting chased down from behind. I've got more pressure. The attackers have more decisions to make. We How also, do we make it? Sorry. We also change partners. Which we is change, we mix it up every time. Different. Yeah, we're picking different cues from yeah. different people. Okay. How do we make that easier if we had to? Less defenders. Less defenders, so we could go down to five. We could have one defender going down different cones. So it could be a three on one. Okay. What else could we do? We could give them the ball. We could give them the ball before they go yeah. round, so they know they've got the ball. Anything else? So I could plant the ball, so I could put the ball in one of the cones, walk away, and right shout. Okay, so then, what should the first player go to? The ball. The ball. Boom, and then the other players react off that. Okay. Anything else? How else could we manipulate it? More space. What was it? Yeah. Big space, we could open it right up, okay. We could put sidelines in, okay, and we could have variable sidelines. We could have orange cones, yeah. we could have blue cones, and say, right, you can go as wide as the blue cones now. All right, Chris, as you say, you manipulate what the defenders do and where you can manipulate where that space is. You can put defenders so you've actually got, say, you've got you use red and white cones and you shout red. They've got to go to the red, but the red actually puts one there and two there, so there's a space up the middle that, that creates an opportunity to attack, so you can actually randomise as well where the defenders come from and actually manipulate that space at the same time, and stuff like that. On these little practices, and we've got one more to go, on these little practices, what's the aim of the session? Find space. Find space. Pass. 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 Score. Score. So it's the same aims as the game we were in there. What am I now not focusing on as much? What have I put my real sight on? What? So a little bit on running lines to the cues, the finding the space, the, the manipulation of the defenders. Because we've from the game in here, what did I identify? Identify that we could, we could find space, we could score tries, and we could make passes. So we, we've got some of these skills already, so what I'm really now pushing you from identifying is to develop our manipulation and our reading of cues. So when we go back into the game in two minutes, what would we hopefully start to see? People reading the cues and the manipulation of it. Okay, so that would be the only reason we would come into these breakout things if we wanted to specifically look at a specialised area. Because what's better? These or that? That. That. I think a mixture of the. A mi two. You can do a mixture, but ultimately, how many people are getting a shot? Six. You know, six. Unless we've got four coaches and we spread it, you know, the same practice across the, the area and all this. So it takes a lot more man hours to do. That's the better thing. Because we're getting the same thing in there. What have, we, what have we done here, though, within these little practices, these Absolutely. little games? Because they're still games, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, because there's still competition, there's still an outcome. Okay, 
what have we done? Yeah, we'll just like that's it. We've just narrowed the focus. So instead of everything going on for the players, we're really narrowing that focus that they've got something specific to look at. This comes back to that planning, doesn't it? That planning of what are we trying to achieve in the session? How do we want to do that? And we might have one coach working here and just pulling out groups of players, six at a time, four at a time, three at a time. Somebody said that earlier, would we do it isolated? split into three teams. Yeah, all these that's just come down to the planning that you have and how your numbers that you have, how you want to do it and structure the session so you get as much time on task as you possibly can.